A popular trend in construction is the natural cement finish, floors and walls in line with modern minimalist architectural designs. Tokyo Superfloor is a self-leveling cementitious flooring compound that gives you that smooth cement look you can be proud of. It's a rapidly setting, self-leveling compound that gives your floors a flat-leveled finish without the guesswork of hand-mixing sand, cement, and epoxies, saving you time, money, and hassle. Its unique chemical composition levels itself, minimizing the need for highly skilled labor and cuts down the time needed to get the perfect finish. Let's see how easy it is to get that professional touch for your floors. You will need a bucket, a hand mixer, a float or wiper, a spiked roller, a polisher, a grinder, a skeg leveler, a sprayer, a terrazzo cutter or diamond cutter. Make sure to only make enough volume that can be applied within 10 minutes. Now, Let's see how you mix Tokyo Superfloor to the right consistency. Pour 5.5 to 6.5 liters of clean water at room temperature into a bucket. Gradually, Empty a 25 kilogram pack of Tokyo Superflow flooring compound while mixing at 500 RPM. Allow this mixture to soak for 3 to 5 minutes. Once again, stir the mixture at a slow speed of 500 RPM using a mechanical mixer or a rod for 8 to 10 minutes. Tokyo Superflow should be completely mixed with the water to make a consistent slurry. Let's move on to the next step and see how Tokyo Superflow is applied. Tokyo Superflow must be applied on either concrete substrate or 1 to 3 screed layered surface. Make sure the surface is clean. Remove any loose particles like sand, mud, oil, grease, wax or polish. You can clean the surface with water, but make sure it's completely dry before applying Tokyo Superflow. Make sure direct sunlight and wind does not enter the surface area while the flooring compound is being applied. If it is a recently laid cement or screed surface, it must be more than 3 weeks old before applying Tokyo Superflow flooring compound. And if the surface temperature is over 28 degrees Celsius, spray water to cool the surface and wait till it is completely dry before applying the flooring compound. On the completely cleaned and dry surface, apply a coat of primer to prevent the formation of pinholes. Now, you can apply the prepared Tokyo Superflow slurry on the dried surface and spread the mixture to a uniform thickness using a wiper, float or a skeg leveler. The recommended minimum thickness of the coating is 5 mm. Use the spiked roller to de-aerate dissolved air from the substrate coating. Let the surface cure in air and do not cure the surface using water. And in just 24 hours, the floor can be used for light foot traffic and you can cut and polish the floor after 7 days. Tokyo Superflow, the smart solution for perfect and smooth cement floors that's cooling to your feet and your eyes. Tokyo Superflow Flooring Compound. Do it right the first time.